विद्यार्थी विज्ञान मंथन और वी वी एम एग्ज़ाम इज़ द इंडियाज़ लार्जेस्ट साइंस टैलेंट सर्च एग्जामिनेशन विच कैन बी गिव इन यूजिंग डिजिटल डिवाइस सो इट द फर्स्ट स्टेज इज़ कम्प्लीटली ऑनलाइन दोज हु क्वालिफाई फॉर द फर्स्ट स्टेज अपीयर फॉर द स्टेट लेवल कैंप एंड देन देर इज़ अ नेशनल लेवल कैंप स्टूडेंट फ्राम क्लास सिक्स टू इलेवन कैन अपीयर फॉर इट द फर्स्ट लेवल इज़ अ मल्टीपल चॉइस क्वेश्चन एंड देन एट द स्टेट एंड द नेशनल लेवल द क्वेश्चन पर टेन टू कॉम्प्रीहेंसिव राइटिंग प्रेजेंटेशन लीडरशिप रोल प्लेइंग ग्रुप डिस्कशन इंटरक्शन प्रैक्टिकल एग्जामिनेशन एंड मेनी मोर सो द आइडिया इज टू have an interest in pure science to understand the traditional indian science get hands on experience on the workshops get mentorship for education uh, in the field of science uh, help and or uh, get an idea about the competitive exams and then identify the real cream the next is uh, what is the syllabus for the very first round you have science and maths from your ncert textbooks which is of 50 marks and logical which is of 10 marks together 60 marks paper which would be checked only after you qualify in the other two papers which is contribution of india towards science 20 questions and the uh, the story of one of the great scientists from india for 20 marks for 2023 this was for cv raman this changes every year so on an yearly basis this would change so just take a note that uh, you have to read uh, the the life story of some scientist from india uh, and this would vary every year so this would be the material which would be provided by the vvm itself now this whole examination would be 1 hour 30 minutes 100 questions one uh, marks for For each question, there are two categories: the junior group six to eight, senior group nine to twelve, in which students would appear for the examination. Now, the pattern of the examination, as I said, would be section A and section B. Those who qualify section A, only for them the section B would be checked, and uh, then the final criteria would be based on the uh, the the complete marks for the students. Now, those. Uh, of the total students who appear, twenty students from each class would get qualified for the state level. From the state, two toppers would be selected, and these two toppers would actually participate at the national level. Now, at the national level again. there would be so at the first level in the school top 3 rankers per school would be given certificate top 3 rankers per class would be given district certificate at the state there would be 20 toppers from each state in each class who would participate in the state level of this two would go to the national level now to those who are going to the national level of these um they would be participating at the national stage and then there would be three rank holders per class who would be given the national winners and three rank holders per class at the zonal level who would be given the award so 18 students at national level and 18 students at the zonal level and they would be given internship along with a scholarship for one year so this was an introduction about vvm thanks for joining here <coughs>